I think it's really becoming, it's really growing. From the time, if you look be, before I started, say I started right, you know, around just before the 90s started, uh, when I had songs on the radio, and, and it was starting to have a real, you know, with the tragically hip, the rodeo, all that stuff, there's a bunch of bands coming into the fold. But before that, when we came in, when Canadian content was brought into play, some people were really criticized it. It's, it's like a subsidy, it's like, you know, and I think is the best thing we ever did for Canadian music and gave, created a whole infrastructure, studios, record companies, all that stuff. And sometimes it takes a long time to really, for it to come to fruition. But if you look out there in the world, for our population, we contribute more mega stuff to the world of music than, than any other country of a similar size. Maybe Ireland would be an exception. But otherwise, we, uh, the expression is we bat, or, or we punch way above our weight or something like that, you know, that expression. It's just we, we're like an underdog team that does really well. We're still being asked when we first, oh yeah, but how is it going, you know, like, are you having any success in the States? I mean, first of all, we're, we're, I mean, an important thing is music, is, the way music is spread around has really changed. It used to be way more territorial. You know, you could be signed to a record label in Canada and then their, their parent company in the States wouldn't release your record. Mm -hmm. So you were kind of screwed in that way. But, but it was, so it was always asked, oh, are they having any success in the States? Well, at a certain point, people, well, who cares? Having a good life, what am I doing? You know, can I go tra travel and tour? And, and, uh, and, and then it just, people in the country stopped, stopped looking to the States to legitimize, or really like this because it's popular yeah. in the States. To hell with that. And uh, so that's been fun, and you know, certainly my new record, Flesh and Bone, really proud of that. So I'm just doing what I do, you know. There were times I wasn't much of a friend.